This is a Kahan TV sports break. Today we highlight some of the teams in the NBA's Eastern Conference. The New York Knicks have been a big story since acquiring former MVP Derrick Rose and former Defensive Player of the Year Joakim Noah to add to their core of Carmelo Anthony and budding starlet Kristaps Porzingis. The Knicks are now on a good run of form under new head coach Jeff Hornacek after starting the season 3-6. and six. They now stand at 12-9 and nine after a solid victory over the struggling Miami Heat. They're tied for third place in the East, but are by no means in the driver's seat to qualify for the playoffs as an Eastern Conference logjam sees third and 11th place separated by just two and a half games. The Detroit Pistons have won four of their last five to pull into the top eight now as Dwayne Wade's 19 points and Jimmy Butler's 32 were not enough to help the Chicago Bulls overcome a balanced Pistons attack at the Palace of Auburn Hills. The Washington Wizards' struggles continued as they dropped to 7-13 with a loss at home to the Orlando Magic despite John Wall scoring 52 points and they are in danger now of missing the playoffs for the second straight season. The Magic got 72 points from their bench with contributions from Jeff Green, Alfred Payton, and Jody Meeks. So here's what the East looks like at the moment. It looks like it'll be another close race down to the wire for playoff spots and home court advantage on the Atlantic coast. In other news, the sporting world is awaiting a heavyweight matchup tonight between the LA Clippers and the Golden State Warriors at Staples Center. Despite the Clippers' apparent lack of consistent intensity early this season, they will be looking to make a statement and stake claim to Western Conference supremacy as they feel injuries have derailed their past two playoff runs and haven't lost to the Warriors in the playoffs, defeating them in seven back in 2014. Subsequently, the Warriors took the title in 2015 and broke the regular season wins record last season on their way to a second straight finals appearance. It will be a new challenge for the Clippers though, as Kevin Durant has been added to the Warriors roster to complement Steph Curry, Draymond Green, and Klay Thompson, who is coming off of dropping 60 points in three quarters this past Monday against the Pacers. The Clippers will be coming in with their familiar core of Chris Paul, Blake Griffin, J.J. Redick, and DeAndre Jordan in what many are calling the Clippers' last chance at a title run this season, as Paul and Griffin will be free agents this summer. This will be our first look at this potential playoff matchup this season. It should be an interesting one. That is all for this edition of Sports Break. Have a wonderful day.